Did you know Einstein's brain was stolen after his death and carried in a jar for decades? In 1955, the world's most famous genius dies at Princeton Hospital. But here's where things get weird. The pathologist, Thomas Stoltz Harvey, removes Einstein's brain during the autopsy. Not for display, not for science, at least not officially. He just keeps it. For years. In jars. In his basement. Sometimes in a cider box. POV, the world's smartest carry-on. Harvey drives cross-country with the brain, handing out slices to researchers like the world's creepiest charcuterie. Some studies claim the brain has unusual features. Others? Not so much. Was it genius? Or just a guy obsessed with gray matter? Permission from Einstein's family? Let's call it complicated. Decades later, what's left of the brain finally returns to an institution. So, was science advanced? Or did we just witness history's weirdest road trip? Would you trust your legacy to a guy with a jar?